gasoline I smell? Welcome back to the channel guys, I hope you all are doing amazing as always and it's me Joe as always and today guys I want to talk about Scream 6 and to be exact I want to talk about Ghostface and uh, you know the way he was in Scream 6 and why I think that it really worked. Now before we get into it guys hit that like button or if you're new here consider subscribing to the channel it helps me a lot so thank you so much for doing that. But now let's talk about Ghostface in Scream 6. I really have to say that Ghostface in Scream 6 I thought that was just I thought that it was perfection. You know I thought the way Ghostface was done in Scream 6 was just pure perfection and you might be like but he was like maybe way too brutal and I and I would say no yeah he was pretty brutal but I think that he was you know a ghost face that was that exactly knew what he wants you know and I think the ghost the way ghost face was done was just really clever and it was also really good especially how brutal he was especially how you know visceral he was and how he was just like yeah you know I have to kill you and you know I know that it sounds weird but th th in this regard he was just so professional you know uh if you take Ghostface from like OG Scream or Scream 2 or Scream 3 or even Scream 4 uh you know, or even Scream 5, essentially, uh, in these movies, Ghostface was sometimes kind of uh, a douchebag, you know, he was really unprofessional and just really messy with his stuff, you know, uh, but in this movie, Ghostface is like, or, or seems like a professional killer, you know, like a killing machine almost, and that was definitely something that I really enjoyed about this portrayal of Ghostface, that, uh, you know, he, he wasn't just, like, you know, goofing around. You know, that scene, uh, you know, in the deli where he, he, he's just, he just kills a guy and then he takes his shotgun and kills, uh, you know, a guy with a shotgun. That, that was, like, such a great scene and Ghostface was, in this whole movie, was just so brutal and... I think that it really worked well, you know, and I think that uh, the, the, the the whole sort of like scene, for example, where the core four and Anika are trying to get to the other apartment by, uh, you know, crossing uh, on, on that ladder, that was so good, like that was a fantastic scene and Ghostface was just brutal in that scene, you know, how he was like shaking with the ladder, that was just so cool. And uh, then when Anika falls down, it's just, it's sad, it's brutal, it's intense, but it worked so well, you know? And I think that's that, that has to do with how Ghostface was portrayed in this movie, because I think that it just worked really well. And honestly, I, I think that this might be my favorite portrayal of Ghostface, you know? I really do like the goofy Ghostface uh, in, in, in the first Scream movie. Uh, but this ghost face is just so brutal and just so just evil that, that it just works really well, you know? And uh, yeah, I think that this m might be my favorite portrayal of Ghostface because he just he's just like a professional killer, you know? He's like a killing machine. And it works really well. Uh, you know, it really matches the tone of this movie, which Scream 6 is like really dark. Uh, but, but it like, I think that it fits like really, really well. So yeah, guys, these are essentially my thoughts about Ghostface in Scream uh, 6. I think that he was really brutal, uh, you know, really visceral, really just like out there and really like a professional killer. Th th that's sort of the vibe I got, uh, you know, when I was watching the movie. So I really enjoyed Ghostface in Scream 6 and I think that uh, this portrayal of Ghostface was just really well done. And honestly, I think that we should that we should expect a ghost face like this from now on. I'm not saying that we'll get a, you know, a ghost face this brutal, you know, e with each new entry, but I would love to see that, because, like, in this movie, he really felt like a threat. You know, he was really, you know, obviously in all the Scream movies, he feels like a threat every time he shows up. But especially in this movie, I felt that he was just so... 
just just like a danger you know he was like pure danger really enjoyed ghostface in this one anyway guys that's all for today thank you so much for watching this video uh i'll see you in the next one take care as always and bye